Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to remove a keyboard on your iPhone. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, let's just open up Safari and I'll tap the bottom here to pull up the keyboard. You can see at the very bottom left is a little globe and that's how I switch between different keyboards that I have. You can see the space where it says space, it turns to Spanish, English, US, Espanol, Mexico. So you can see those are two different keyboards that I have on my iPhone. And you can also see the little emoji button. That's another keyboard that I have on my iPhone. Say if there's a keyboard that you don't want anymore, or if you've moved or you're in a different country, you can always change that keyboard to something else. Let's get out of there and head into our settings to be able to remove one of those keyboards. Let's scroll down until we get to general. And then we will scroll down and right under date and time, we'll tap on keyboard. Now, the very top, it says keyboard and a three next to it. That means I have three keyboards active. I can tap on that and you can see all three keyboards here. Now I can tap on the edit at the top right here and say if I want to remove the Spanish keyboard, I can tap the little minus button and hit delete. Now that keyboard is deleted from my iPhone. I can hit done at the top right. And of course, if you ever just want to add a new one, you hit add new keyboard and you can scroll through that list and find a keyboard that you'd like to add and add it to the keyboard on your iPhone. Hope this helps. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments below and make sure to subscribe. Thanks.